Hello everyone, welcome to Family Farming in the Philippines. Hopefully this camera will work properly. I was up there in the middle of the tank yesterday and went to put it in my pants pocket and ended up uh, dropping it in one of the tanks and it went swimming. Uh, but that was yesterday and today's today, so uh, we're going to test drive it. Hopefully it's dried out enough. Um, we're, we can't work on the round tank right now because we're waiting on Marcel to uh, bring back the, the actual real Sahara. So, because this needs doing as well, uh, Tate's got this all lined out, all leveled and marked out. And so, we're going to begin here on uh, raising the walls of these uh, breeder tanks. That guy's over there cutting some form bar because what we're going to do here, I, I try to learn from uh, not necessarily my mistakes, but I try to learn as I go to make things easier. And so when we had um, breeders in these tanks before uh, we had we actually had a, a, a decent setup it was a, a fine screen net with a the larger hole the green net inside of that and that worked fairly well except it was it was just kind of a pain the way that we had it set up because we had boards nailed along the top here and that's how we attach the nets and all that we're doing uh, we're doing something different. So since Tatai is redoing the walls, raising the walls on this, it's very simple just to take a piece of form bar like this and put it in the fresh in the fresh concrete as an anchor point for the new nets. We're still going to do it the uh, the same way. We're going to do it. Um, uh, uh, screen net and then a, a large green net inside of that to just just to make it easy to uh, remove the uh, the adult breeder fish and leave the uh, fry in the tank uh, it's easy to check and see if there's fry in that in the tank because you just raise the net out and if there is, then we'll transfer. Probably that first tank there is where they're all going to. We're going to make three separate uh, little containment tanks there because the the fry, when they're tiny, they most definitely have to be separated, not only from the adults but from the other juveniles as well. The juveniles actually eat the inch and a half, two inch, two and a half inch, are uh, really prey on the just hatched. Uh, fry the adults less so but they would they do as well so uh, we need a place to separate them so that is putting these anchors all along here and I've decided that we're going to these these two large tanks here are going to be uh, well we're gonna make four breeder tanks out of these two large tanks so we'll have eight quote-unquote breeder tanks all together these four right here and then two and two and these two tanks three tanks here will be uh, fish for sale and fingerlings and this tank here will be for fry really only need one tank for fish for sale but again we need nets as well so uh, we're going to be uh, driving in a lot of that form bar. Tantai and Eboy are both getting that on the on the wall, so maybe we'll be able to get this done today. It's going up pretty quick. Of course, it has to, you know, you can see by this line, I mean, maybe you can see. The line is right here, so 
we got several inches. Several. I mean, we've got six inches or so. That all this needs to be brought up. So it's gonna it's gonna take some product, both in cement, sand, and labor. But it needs to be done. Well, the lovely Marcel has pirated my crew. It's exactly what you did. Yeah. So, we don't have the uh, time to do this exactly right. Marcel wants a place to park her car. I can absolutely understand that. So, for right now, it's just going to be a tarp, a trapal. Are you going to be happy with that, ma'am? Mm. The next day? The next day? It will be at end of no, it will not, because right. the next day they're working on the round tank. Maybe next week, okay. if you're a good girl. So we're going to be giving up on these two mango trees right here. We're going to be cutting them down. They haven't produced anything since the typhoon. That was almost three years ago. Uh, I'm over it. And, um, you know, it's just, although they do provide shade, mainly what they're going to provide on the roof of this carport, I guess you could call it, is leaves and a mess. And uh, we're at some point soon, as time permits, we're going to add those two solar panels right there. And this tree already blocks that last, shades that last two panels in that string right there in the morning. And they most definitely will shade the next two. So they're coming down. Yes, Mommy. The guys are coming right on along here. So this end side, whatever you want to say, is done. Um, basically, this corner here is pretty much done. I don't know I don't know if they're gonna make it today or not. Maybe. I thought this would just be like a half day project, but I guess I'm I guess I was sorely mistaken. The guys are it's like mid afternoon the guys are mixing probably their last mix for the day so I don't know we shall see well, as you can see Tata never passes up an opportunity for a good time I don't know if you could really call it swimming or not but
that's about what we're going to get done today. I just fed the fish. I'm running a little, running through a little bit extra water uh, because of. Well, I'm sure some of some of this fresh concrete has fallen into the water, so I'm just going to flush it out a little bit extra. And I can tell by the twitchings around in that water there that there's another batch or two of fry in there. Right there. I can just tell now the tiny fish, how they make things move. And there's some tiny ones there that are just trying to eat the fish food I just threw in there. So yeah, there it's it's getting close to five, and there's it's not enough time to make another mix and get it put up now. So uh, about done with what is going to take the most mix product, whatever you want to call it. So I would anticipate that they would be finished with this by noontime tomorrow, and then they can. Uh, get the round tank done as well. Thank you everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.